Hi, hi everyone. We are live. So I want to say hi, first of all, uh, to everyone who's going to be watching this live, um, either right now or later. And I want to thank my special guest today, Amar Hira. Um, Amar, thank you very much for accepting my invitation to come here today and kind of share your experience, your knowledge about a hot topic that we're going to be talking about today with a lot of our sure. audiences that they wanted to hear. So um, if you don't mind, I'm just going to uh, get you to go on the stage kind of a thing and uh, <laughs> let sure. us know who you are and where you live and like, kind of a little bit about yourself. Please. Absolutely. Well, good evening, Mahasa. It was so it's so wonderful to be here. Thank you so much for the invite. I always uh, enjoy these, and it's a pleasure to be here and uh, always connecting with our business partners across the globe. I know we're just talking about it again. We've not met in person, but you know we're looking forward to that amazing convention that's going to be happening yes. soon, and uh, hopefully we will all be meeting in person. But uh, again, thank you so much, and good evening to you. Uh, my name is Amar, as Marsha said. I am based in Florida. Uh, been here for a little bit about eight years, uh, but I've been in the U.S. for over 20 years. Um, I live here with my wife and kid, a beautiful family, and uh, we are happily settled here. But uh, prior to this, of course, I was based in different parts of the U.S. My background is primarily in uh, hospitality and retail sales, which I spent almost two decades in. Um, and then, uh, you know, Post-pandemic, I transitioned into uh, working in the finance industry and doing uh, something online. As uh, as you know, a lot of businesses transitioned as well. So it kind of just made sense. But uh, most importantly, I was very keen on doing something on the side apart from my regular career. And I wanted to have that safety net. Uh, the pandemic was an eye-opener for a lot of us. So it kind of just tied in. Uh, the timing was good. In, uh, uh, looked into this online venture. I did my due diligence, and uh, here I am today as a business partner, just like you, and uh, online entrepreneur. Awesome! That's great. Thank you very much for introducing yourself, and again, thank yeah. you for uh, accepting my invitation. Um, I'm just going to be for maybe some audience that are new to your page or to my page. I'm just going to be introducing myself a little bit as well. Uh, I've been uh, in Canada, Nova Scotia. Uh, it's a little bit like a little province, like almost right in the ocean. <laughs> and uh, I have been here with my family for 17 years. I have um, almost a nine-year-old son. He's going to be nine in August. And with my husband, we live here. And uh, my parents, my family. And um, my background is finance as well, kind of a thing. I started as a banker, and then I moved to insurance. And I've been doing insurance for almost 10 years now. And um, as you said, um, the reason that I started to have like my own business without having any kind of a mindset of a business owner, uh, pandemic was a big hit. And uh, I realized that I definitely like as a family, we need a plan B and we cannot kind of rely on just a job like being an employee. So that was the reason that I started to search around and I found this amazing system and I joined in like yourself as well. Awesome. So uh, I want to just jump into the question because I know that a lot of people uh, are watching us and they love to hear about this topic uh, as if we, as like this business, this system that we're connected to and uh, we are operating through this system and kind of connected to a few mm -hmm. companies mm -hmm. uh, that they kind of pay us for the commission. <clears throat> Do we recruit people or are we like an MLM system? Great question, uh, Marta. And yes, absolutely. I know a lot of people are skeptical. They have apprehensions because there's so many different options online and some are legit and some are not. Uh, but to your question, uh, I would say no. Uh, and the reason I say that is because, uh, you know, first of all, we're one of those few privileged organizations that is affiliated or associated or recognized by the DSA. So we are direct sales that the DSA is the Direct Sales Association. So when you do become a business owner or a distributor with this particular organization, you are automatically considered a home-based business, uh, an ind individual, number one. Number two, um, you know, we're very different. And the reason I say that why we're not an MLM is because uh, typically with an MLM, uh, right off the top, you have to 
uh, pay a monthly subscription and membership, uh, which is due every month. Uh, the most critical thing is you are under a lot of pressure because you've got to hit sales targets every month. Mm -hmm. uh, you have to have, you do have to recruit in an MLM, which we don't, because for the biggest differentiation is uh, we're not recruiting people. We're offering them a opportunity uh, to come on board uh, and try our platform, which is a proven and tested system. And it's an opportunity to become a social media or as in an online business partner with us. So we're not necessarily recruiting. We don't do any direct sales. A lot of that is handled by, uh, you know, back office and we don't need to worry about that. Mm -hmm. uh, going back to the MLM. Yes, you have to, of course, uh, have a membership. You've got to hit your daily, uh, sorry, your monthly sales targets. A lot of that is done by recruiting people as your downline and they've got to hit those targets. In our particular business model, you don't need to do that. You know, you're independent. You can achieve your own targets. Uh, you don't have to depend on your downline. Um, and then comes the part about the commissions and how do you get paid? Well, mm -hmm. this is the most critical part. With an MLM, you are permanently under somebody and you're not going to be necessarily getting all the commission for your work and your sales because there's going to be somebody above you. Whereas in our particular business model, uh, once you rank up to a certain point, you do cut off your upline completely. And so you are totally responsible for all the commission and entitled to all the commissions of the sales you make. Um, uh, so you don't have to depend on that downline. And most importantly, you don't have to worry about uh, your upline as much. That said, the other thing about this business that stood out to me is, uh, you know, if you don't hit your sales targets, that's okay because we don't have any sales targets. Mm -hmm. uh, so you can literally step away from the business uh, for a few months uh, if you need to and take a break. And you don't have to worry about being deranked. Um, and same goes for your downline or your uh, business team or your partners who work with you. Um, vice versa, you can uh, be in the business as long as you want. I mean, you can literally uh, pass it on to your uh, next generation and your kids, which is one of the biggest reasons that attracted me in this business, is uh, building that legacy and being able to hand, hand over that uh, security business model to my children as and when they need it. So I think those are the key differentiations here uh, between an MLM and what we stand for. I hope uh, that's not too confusing, but uh, <laughs> yeah, I think that in a nutshell answers it right there. No, that was great. Thank you very much. You explained it very well and kind of you compared like how we operate and how an MLM sure. kind of operates. So thank you very much for sharing that. And I hope that um, people that are watching or watching later, they understood that what are the different differences. And I want to mm -hmm. point out one thing as well, like MLM com companies, they're usually like we know, like in um, I know that in Canada and also in the United States, I'm pretty sure that it's not kind of like a, a legal system. So they don't um, they are not registered company technically. Right. So but we are registered company and the companies that we work with as well, the companies that we have like um, as kind of connected to our system, they are registered company as well. Absolutely. So we pay taxes on our business. Like we are, we are like a small business owners. So mm -hmm. we have like in Canada, we call it T4A. T4. Right. Uh, that is a kind of like a Canadian um, small business uh, tax right. that we uh, that mm -hmm. we claim, and we do that. Like all of us that are in Canada, United States, like this this uh, this business is kind of global. So anyone, anywhere that they have, they kind of follow their their own uh, legal uh, and government uh, requirements um, mm -hmm. to pay taxes. So right. this is another, I think, big differentiation between the MLM and our system as well, that we pay taxes on our uh, our business. And right. another thing, amazing thing about our business is that um, I know that most of the MLMs, they don't have anything like that. It's mentorship. So we are mentors here and we are technically educating people, as you mentioned, like through making content and kind of giving, informing um, everyone who likes to join the online space and use it as, a, like I say, second or third income or just kind of having their own free time, maybe with their family, that's, if mm -hmm. that's their goal or if they want to get retired earlier, if that's their goal and everything like that, we inform them that there is a system that we can get connected to. 
and started and we are on their side like we are like you amar and myself a lot of other business owners here we are on the side of our um, right. people that like they come they come as a met as a business owner and we help them to go through our training system which is a mm -hmm. very very throw training and we are with them like having zooms almost every week with our coaches with our, with the mentors and we help them. We don't kind of let them to kind of come in. We are not looking to recruit people and kind of gather as many as people as we want and then kind of let go of them and not mm -hmm. help them. We are actually mentors here. And at the, there is a level that we get to be a coach as well. And they're always training through that. So it's a very comprehensive and uh, completed system that everything is provided to us and as you said, we don't do any direct sales uh, like our like the company mm -hmm. that connected to us. They do all the sales and the system does a lot of things automatic for us. So we are not reaching friends. We are not reaching families. We don't do cold calls. We don't send cold emails to strangers and things like that, that most of the MLMs uh, does. True. So uh, these are the things that came up to my mind as well. Other than the, like, I think that you completed everything. You actually explained very well. So I'm very glad that you. we had you here today to explain this. We still have a few minutes. I wanted to guys just kind of hit the 15 minutes. And I want yeah. to ask you one more question, Amar. Um, we have like some people that reach out to us and they say like, we see that most people here are women. Mm -hmm. It's kind of like a business for women. <laughs> So another reason that I have you here today, because I know that you are one of the most kind of successful men in this um, kind of like a system here and you do great and you have like lots of knowledge that you share with your um, everyone that kind of around you, even like us as um, kind of uh, business partners. So Thank could you. you just let us know that how this works for you? Because we're making content, we go lives and things right. like that. And some people, they feel like that women are kind of could be maybe a stronger in those kind of a thing. Is right. it kind of a struggle for you? Is it a challenge for you? Or how do you handle those? So a great point. I mean, I was going to say, let me remove my mask and you'll see the woman <laughs> in me. Uh, no, this business is uh, for anybody and everybody. I mean, whether you're a senior profession with decades of experience or you're somebody who's just starting out and has no idea it's not uh, uh, gender biased uh, yes there is a major there is a certain group of uh, women who are doing it very successfully they are actually people we look up to as role models in in the organization so kudos to them they've earned that spot but as a dad as a man in this business I don't see it challenging. I don't see a struggle in it. I, you know, and thank you so much for recognizing. Yes, I have had some success. Hopefully, many, uh, many more success and milestone to come. Just like uh, wish you the same. But um, no, uh, it's about just sticking to your principles of consistency and discipline. Uh, you know, connecting with folks out there because this business is about helping others. Mm -hmm. You know. Uh, I think the two or three critical whys that we all see, which are very common in 99% of our global community is, uh, you know, looking for the same thing, wanting to be around your loved ones longer and having that freedom and flexibility of time. And also uh, being, uh, you know, stress-free when it comes to, uh, you know, the financial aspects of it so that you can have that security and that safety net to fall back on. You don't need to depend on maybe one source or one single earner in the family. Uh, God forbid something happens, you have an emergency uh, fund or plan B to fall back on. So yeah, uh, you know, for me as a dad and a husband, uh, my wife was very much supportive of me with when I started doing this. She understood uh, why I want to do this. She saw the logic and the reason behind it. And so that's what I tell a lot of men who reach out to me as well. I mean, wouldn't you want that as the number one priority for your family? What are we really doing as parents, right? We want to secure our family and our children's future and the next generation, right? But at the same time, not be uh, stressed out every month trying to make ends meet and uh, you know, trying to just get by. So uh, in today's time, when you have technology and you have information and you have 
a platform that is ready to go uh, with uh, falling back on what you're saying with the most amazing training program and unlimited uh, mentorship and coaching from some amazingly successful people. I don't see this being any tougher for men versus women. If yes. that I think is the bottom line. <laughs> yes. Yeah, absolutely. I agree with you. And uh, as, as you mentioned, there is no kind of a limitation in kind of like where you come from, what's your background, what's, what's your kind of gender or nothing. It's right. just all about the mindset that you put into it. You believe it, you are yep. consistent, you are coachable. And then True. the rest is done through the system. Absolutely. And, and that, you know, I stick by those two principles, discipline and consistency. You've just got to bring that to your, you know, your A game every day. You just have to have that, you know. Absolutely. Yes, that, that's great. Thank you very much, Amar. It was a very great informative uh, session, like an interview that we had. So again, thank you for accepting uh, my invitation, coming here. I know that you're very busy as well and uh, i wanted to just uh, say that anyone who's watching and still has questions or want to know more uh, you can definitely don't hesitate to reach out to amar or myself and sure. we are more than happy to give you more information the first step is always going through our watching our free mm -hmm. complimentary webinar and then uh, we can definitely um, show you the steps from there Absolutely. and we are here to help you we are here to an answer your questions and we'll be more than happy to welcome uh, you into our amazing community here yeah. thank you so much Mahasa. again it was wonderful uh being here thank and uh, again it's a pleasure talking with you and all our audiences who are tuning in thank you so much for your time and uh, yeah i wish you all the best and a wonderful rest of the evening Thank you. You too as well, Amar. Have a great one. Have a great one, everyone. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.